Good evening, everybody. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Thanks for joining us on TCM and the end of 31 Days of Oscar. We have one more double feature to go, one final pairing of Oscar winning or nominated films. Coming up, two soap opera epics released in consecutive years, 1956 and 1957. In a few hours, we'll have one of the seminal melodramas of Hollywood history, a sweeping story of love, family expectations, race, and emotional growth set on a Texas ranch, George Stevens's 1956 Best Picture Oscar nominee, Giant. But first, from MGM in 1957, Elizabeth Taylor, Montgomery Clift, and Eva Marie Saint star in Rain Tree County. For a time, Rain Tree County held the title as the most expensive movie ever made, coming in at just under $6 million. Based on the best-selling novel by Ross Lockridge, Jr., film is set in fictional Rain Tree County, Indiana. It's the story of a young man starting with his high school graduation and following him through the end of the Civil War and beyond. Clift plays that young man who finds himself torn between two women, his longtime love, played by Eva Marie Saint, and a newcomer to the county, that's Elizabeth Taylor, earning her first Oscar nomination. Production for Rain Tree County began in 1956, but a few weeks into production, Clift suffered extensive injuries in a car crash just after leaving a dinner party at Taylor's home. Taylor was one of the first to arrive at the scene of the accident, and she immediately climbed into the wrecked car through the back door and cradled Clift in her arms. Clift was in pretty bad shape, but he managed to motion toward his neck that he couldn't breathe. The impact of the crash had knocked out two of his teeth, and they had lodged in his throat. Without flinching, Elizabeth Taylor reached inside his mouth and pulled the teeth out, holding him until the ambulance arrived. Cliff's face was badly damaged in the accident. He had a broken jaw, a broken nose, and those missing teeth. Production on the film was shut down for eight weeks while he recovered. As you watch, you may note close-ups that seem to favor the right side of Cliff's face as the left still showed some effects of his injuries. From 1957, directed by Edward Dimitrick, also with Lee Marvin and Agnes Moorhead, featuring an Oscar-nominated score from Johnny Green, Rain Tree County. The close friendship between Elizabeth Taylor and Montgomery Clift began when they starred together in A Place in the Sun, released in 1951. Five years later, Taylor talked Clift into starring opposite her in Rain Tree County, but Clift suffered serious injuries in a car crash just after shooting began. The recovery accentuated his need for alcohol and painkillers, and his substance abuse adversely affected the production. Despite his considerable inner turmoil, Cliff turned out an impressive performance, as did Taylor. Taylor earned her first Oscar nomination for the movie, beginning a four-year run of nominations for Best Actress that included Rain Tree County, Cat on a Hot Tin Roof, Suddenly Last Summer, and Butterfield 8, which finally won her the Oscar. She won her second Oscar for Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf? from 1966. Coming up, another soap opera epic starring Elizabeth Taylor. This time she joins James Dean, Rock Hudson, and Mercedes McCambridge in a Texas-sized family saga based on a story by Edna Ferber. <laughs> 